yeah it's the whole thing is a learning process for me yeah <laughs> but it's getting better anyway okay are you comfortable yes okay hey guys welcome back to my channel this is Ollie's mom today a very exciting guest here Amina hi can you introduce yourself yes <laughs> So my name is Amina and I have a YouTube channel called Experiencing Fragrances with Amina. So um, we found out that we live in the same city so I decided to come over and or come together and do a collaboration. <laughs> Alright so I have 12 fragrances of mine that I thought that she would like but then remember that I am a newbie and I tend to like a more feminine, mass pleasing <laughs> perfume. <laughs> yeah, and for me and my taste, I tend to go more for louder, typically more unisex uh, fragrances, sometimes a little bit more obscure um, that are not mass appealing. So this should be an interesting experience. Let's see. <laughs> um, so this is my attempt as a normal perfume collector to impress the frag head. <laughs> I'm gonna title this frag head tried my stash. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Are you ready? Look. Yes, I am ready. I wonder if I can at least guess what it is, you know, because I've seen a lot of your videos and I think I know, I, of course I don't know your whole entire collection, but I'm thinking maybe I can guess. Okay. I'll try. I'll try. All right. <laughs> Close your eyes. Okay. Eyes are closed. Open your eyes. Okay. I can already smell it's something. Ooh. This is fruity. Mm -hmm. It's super feminine for sure. Fru fruity, florally. I don't know what this is. <laughs> do you like it? I do like it. I don't think it's something that I would wear, you know, but it's very feminine. It's very sweet. It's fruity. I mean, I like it, but it's not my style. But it's nice. I can see like it's just a very feminine lady wearing something like this. I don't know. I don't think I've guessed this one. Viva la Juicy Noir. Really? Yeah. Viva. Okay. Yeah. I wouldn't have guessed that. I don't think I've ever smelled that before. Good to know. <laughs> I've never smelled that one before. So right. I, I wouldn't have guessed it to be so fruity. I would have thought it would be more gourmandy sweet. Mm. I would have. That's what I would assume because yeah. it's like noir and then. Yeah. Yeah. It's nice. But it's not my style. Yeah. <laughs> I know. Ooh. Open your eyes. Okay. I'm not a fan of this one. You don't? You don't like it? No. This is also fruity. Is it fruity? It smells like candy. Uh, smells like. It is fruity. Yeah. It also smells like, like a bathroom freshener. Like a really fancy potpourri. That's what it smells like. Okay. I mean, it's not off-putting, but... Okay. It's really popular. Another really popular one. Okay. I don't think I'm going to be able to guess any of these. Is this a celebrity? <laughs> yes, yeah, a celebrity. Okay. I don't know. She never smelled it before. I've never smelled this one before. <laughs> yeah, I'm not a huge fan, but I can't stop smelling it though. Yeah. I'm waiting for it to change is what All it right. is. But it's not my favorite. I, okay. I don't like it. Right. I wouldn't wear that. No. <laughs> Rihanna Rebel Fleur. Really? Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> people are gonna hate me. I know a lot of people really like that fragrance. Right. And I've never tried it before. People are gonna hate me. I'm sorry. I feel bad for not liking it. <laughs> well, but this is the channel where we're gonna be truthful. So exactly. Okay. Yeah, okay. That's fine. I don't like Rihanna Rebel Fleur. Fight me. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so number three. Okay, close, close your eyes. eyes. Yes. Hmm. This is definitely more brighter. Citrus in here, maybe? I'm making you smell something that you don't like. I feel really guilty. No, no, I mean, they're not bad scents. Okay. They don't smell terrible. I just try and imagine myself wearing it, and I, like, those first two, I couldn't see myself wearing. Right. Like, if I smelled it at a store, I wouldn't buy those, basically. Right. But this one's kind of. 
I think so far I may like this one the best out of the three. I could tell. This one's a bit more interesting than the other ones, but for me I get still a little bit of fruitiness, but more brighter fruits. Okay. Like I'm I'm seeing I'm thinking maybe citrus, but then there's a bit of sweetness in there as well. Mm. I like this one. You like this yeah, one? I like this one. Would I wear it? Maybe. Maybe. I like this one. Okay. I like this one. Yeah. I, I can't guess though. I can't okay. guess what it is. You want to know what it is? Do, is it a popular one as well? Uh, I guess. No, not so popular, but it's quite popular. Okay. What is it? Rihanna Rowe. Oh, this is another Rihanna one. Yeah. So I, Whoa, I don't like think it. I've heard that one. Okay. It's yeah. this one. Oh. It's supposed to be like a dupe for a Bodega Fanetta. Okay. Bodega Fanetta. So it has like suede leather. Hmm. I, I wouldn't have guessed that there was leather in here or suede. But I, I know it's, it's definitely sweet. I do get like a sweet fruit, but this one to me is a bit more sophisticated than the others. The others? Yeah. Yeah. I do like this one. Really? Okay. Cool. These are all fragrances I haven't smelled before. Number four. This smells familiar. It smells familiar. I don't know if I have it though, but it smells like I've smelled this one before. It smells really nice. It smells really tropical. I can... I can probably even see myself wearing this like on a vacation, like a beach vacation. It's kind of alluring as well. I like this one. Oh, I might have to get me one of these. So it's, I guess it's a heavy floral fragrance. Um, it's coconut, I, frangipani. Okay. You no, know, I smelled coconut right when I put it in. I smelled the coconut and then I didn't smell it anymore. Yeah. So I was going to say coconut, but I didn't say it because it went away right like immediately. Because I like it. Oh, I good. Like it. Mm -hmm. I don't know about this one. <laughs> no. Uh, it's powdery. It smells yeah, like it deodorant, is and I don't like powdery scents. You don't like powdery? Mm -hmm. No. Trace amounts, I could do it, but if it's predominantly iris, I don't like. Okay. Yeah, I don't like okay. it. It smells like deodorant. Okay. Mm. <laughs> it smells like deodorant, like a Dove deodorant or something. Ugh, no. No? No. <laughs> Alright, so it's Narciso, Narciso. Um, <laughs> I feel bad. I know a lot of people like that one. I like this one. But I, I just don't like powdery scents. You don't like I'm powdery scents? Mm -mm, mm -mm. Do you smell feta fur? I thought you liked this because it's heavy in feta fur. You smell it I can kind bottle? of get the vetiver in there. Not really. Because vetiver to me tends to come off as clean. Like okay. Very um, soapy and clean. And this, I think because of the powderiness, I just can't get over that. Okay. I No. No. Oh. Hmm. It's a no for me. <laughs> no. <laughs> it's a no for me. <laughs> yeah. Alright, next. This one's a little bit better. Yeah? A little bit better, but I'm not a fan of this either. No? No. No. <laughs> this is the same brand as the one oh, before, okay. so it shares the same DNA. Yeah. I like it better than the, the first one, one, the previous one, yeah, but I don't think this is something that I would wear. Okay. No. No? It's nice though. It's a nice scent, but it's just not for me. Yeah. No. <laughs> no. We're so know. different. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Have you smelled this before? I don't think so, but it has a note in here. Like a green note in here. Like a herbally note. It smells like something that I smelled before, and I'm trying to see what they have in common. Mm. It's not bad. Mm -hmm. It's interesting. This is actually one of the polarizing scents. Oh, yeah? Um, I think this is recently hyped up mm -hmm. in YouTube. Recently hyped up and kind of polarizing. I'm trying to <laughs> deduce here. It has something in here that I can't put my finger on. When you say sandalwood, I can see how, I can see it being like a sandalwoody scent. Mm -hmm. But I still get something herbaceous in there. Something also sweet. Chestnut? It could be chestnut. It could be. I've only smelled a fragrance with a 
chestnut note once and I think I had it not here with me obviously but a replica by the fireplace no to me I think out of all of them so far this is the most interesting one and I can see how it can be polarizing I think I like this one you like this yeah. one okay um, it's Zadig Voltaire. This is her. Okay. Is it salty? Is this a salty one? Um, yeah, it smells salty. Even though there's no salt now. Yeah. It's whipped cream, chestnut, and sandalwood. Okay. But I the, like that one. But the sandalwood here is a Javanol. I did research a little bit. Yeah. And Javanol is also known as Gedolphin. I think that's what it's called. Okay. Um, so this one came across as a little bit rosy, a little bit creamier. I like this one. Um, it's very, it's a beast mode and mm -hmm. long, lasts a long time. Okay, okay. Um, I think did Manahil from the perfume realm just mm -hmm. review it and she said how much she hated it. Yeah, it smells like puke <laughs> after that. I can't undo it. Oh! So, oh shit. So I commented on that review saying like, I think I said something like, oh, that sounds terrible, but I'm intrigued. Right. <laughs> and then she said, you should try it because I think she said something about it being polarizing as well. Right. So that's really funny because I actually do like it. Manahil, if you're watching, <laughs> I like it. <laughs> wow. I, yeah, I think this is really interesting. I like it. Oh, I good. Like this one. Hmm. I have to, I mean, I like it, you know, a lot. I may, I'll have to get the name from you. The what? The name. The name, yeah. Mm -hmm. I'll send you samples. Okay. Oh, nice. Yeah, so you could try it. I can try it, yeah. Nice. Okay, next. Next. Of course, nice. Alright, open your eyes. This is really sweet. Mm -hmm. It smells like a daiquiri. Daiquiri? Okay. Like in the opening right away. I think this is a bit too sweet for me. It just reminds me of a daiquiri. Oh yeah? For some reason, like a strawberry daiquiri. Is there strawberry in here? No. No? No. It's vanilla and kumquat. Oh, okay. But I'm getting also a little bit of like hair product vibe. Like a, like a nice shampoo. Like a nice shampoo. It has that soapy. Or conditioner. Soapy scent. Yeah. It's nice. Yeah? I don't hate it. It's nice. Okay. But I think it's also one of those that's not really my style. Al Harman Junon Noir. So this is a dupe for Sergeoff Dama Bianca. Okay. I haven't tried that one either. Okay, so that is how it's supposed to smell like. The more I'm smelling it, the more I'm liking it. Yeah? Yeah. But it just does have that like shampoo like in the background. I guess it's that soapiness like you were saying. It's nice. Yeah. I'm liking it the more I'm smelling it. Do you know Queen Hans? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, so that's what she likes. Oh, it's she likes this one. Right. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, I watch um, her videos sometimes, yeah. 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 Nice. <laughs> Alright. I can already smell it from here. I like this one. Mm, I knew it! <laughs> I like this one! <laughs> I knew it! <laughs> but there's a bit of funkiness in here, though. Mm. <laughs> That's why I put it in here. There's a little bit of funkiness in this one. It's very interesting. Does this have animal an animalic notes in here? Mm, no. No. It's it's changing a whole bunch. I'm getting some. Is there jasmine in here? Yes. Okay. I think I'm getting the indolicness of the jasmine. That's kind. Of, that's making it kind of funky. But the more I'm smelling it, and now that I know that there's jasmine in there, something's telling me that I don't want to. You could guess. I, okay. Is it a, it's not alien, but is it an alien flank or? Yeah. It is? Okay. Because <laughs> I have alien. Okay. And it kind of reminds me of alien. Uh-huh. I like this one. You like it? I do like it, yeah. All right, so it's alien oud. Oh, shit. I need to get me one of these. Wow. Yes, he likes it. I've never tried this before. <laughs> wow. Well, the only alien I've tried are the regular alien. Mm-hmm. Alien Essence Absolute. Yeah, I love that one. Yeah, yeah. And then I tried one of the aliens that had a red bottle. I tried yeah. it in the store and I didn't like it. You didn't all. like it? So and that then ever since then I just stopped trying other aliens. Okay. So that's an alien fusion, I think? Probably. That's what Probably. it's called. I, like I never smell that one. 
I knew. I like this one. <laughs> wow. Okay. Okay. Next. Number Here, 10. Here's the strip if you need. All right. This one's definitely like sharp. Like. It's weird because it's there, but it's not there at the same time. Do you recognize it? I don't think so. Okay. This is weird. It is weird. Yeah. It's one of the polarizing scents, so I thought you might like it. <laughs> I pick all the weird one. <laughs> no, is it, this is strange because I smell it and then I kind of, it kind of, I don't know, it's doing some weird stuff on this paper. I don't know. You gonna try it on the skin? Maybe. I'm intrigued on this. Mm -hmm. I can't really make out any notes I per se. It. I know it. I know it. <laughs> but there's a creaminess in here. Yeah. That's probably from the benzoin and vanilla. Okay, so there's vanilla benzoin. But yeah, I do definitely get like a creaminess in mm -hmm. this one. Have you tried this before? Have you worn this? Yeah, I've worn it. Does it last long on you? Last a long really? time. I'm okay. not sure if I want it to last that long. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay. <laughs> it makes me sleep right away. <laughs> wow. This is one of the perfume that makes gives me headache and then put me to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> I like this, but there's something in here that also reminds me of like a bathroom freshener. There is a lemon? Maybe maybe it's a lemon in here. Shalimar Souffle ah. Intense Girl on. <laughs> wow. Okay. You know I have wait, I only smelled Shalimar for the first time mm -hmm. when I was coming from Scotland. Wow. Wow. So is this a polarizing scent? Uh, to me it is. To me it smells like stale air. <laughs> I can get I can get that. I can get the stale airness in here, yes. But I don't mind it. To me, I feel like I would wear this maybe at nighttime. I wouldn't wear this during the day. Yeah. It has that rubbery, like burn tire note to I me. I can see that. To my nose. I can smell that as well. Which to me isn't really a bad thing. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. You like it? I like it? it. It's a bit feminine, but I can see myself wearing this. Okay. Yeah. And mm. souffle intense. Cool. Okay. This is nice. Yeah? Mm -hmm. I love it. Hmm, it's a pretty floral type scent. I'm getting just something familiar in here. I do like this one. I like this one. Yeah? Yeah. It's tuberose. Oh my god, seriously? Yeah. Oh, wow. <laughs> you know, I was also saying the other day, I don't know who I was speaking to. Saying that I don't like tuberose. You don't like tuberose? No, she loves tuberose. But I like this one. <laughs> I like this. You like this? Yeah. I love it. I'm getting some a bit of like tropicalness in here for some reason. There's like a lang? Maybe it's that. Maybe it's a lang. I like this. I like this. Yeah? Yeah. Well, it's a nice one. Well, it's also quite feminine as well. And the bottle is really nice. I love it's it's fancy. It's weighty. It mm -hmm. feels really good in the hand. Hmm. Have you tried any other from this house? Uh no. Okay. I'm gonna try this one. I blind bought it. <laughs> oh you did? Yeah. Based on the notes or you just Yeah, because yeah. I'm into tuberose, so okay. I thought I like it. Well if you know you like tuberose, then you know. Shoot. There's one tuberose fragrance that I have as a sample. I should have brought them, but I didn't. Damn, it's alright. Next time. Yeah. I like this bottle. It feels really heavy. I like, I like this. I need to probably get me one of these too. Yeah. I like this one. Mm -hmm. Okay. A tuberose that I actually like. It's a good one. I told you. <laughs> in that video. <laughs> <laughs> alright, so the last one. Okay. I'm not sure if you like the last one, okay? Okay. But, mm, I don't think I like this. <laughs> I knew it. No. no. There's something in here. I don't know what it is, but it smells like Flintstones vitamins. <laughs> okay, it's pineapple. <laughs> oh I like pineapple, but this. I'm getting very Flintstones vitamins. Mm. <laughs> I've never tried that Flintstone vitamins. Oh, you haven't? Uh -uh. Okay, so when we were kids, it's like. 
these uh, they kind of <laughs> remind me of clay okay <laughs> but they're supposed to be like sweet candy like vitamins for kids so that they can take their daily vitamins you know okay and they were a bit sweet so i remember as a kid we'd always like eat like two or three i'm sure that was not you know right but <laughs> because we thought they were like candy yeah my daughter does, does that too hmm is this does it have iris in here uh i'm not sure because it's coming off a bit powdery okay that's probably why you don't like it yeah maybe and also like the flintstones vitamins <laughs> like i said <laughs> it reminds me of a, like clay okay which is when I think of clay, I think of not it wet, but also it dry and it's also dusty. Okay. It's not bad, but I won't wear this one. Yeah. You want to know what it is? Yeah. Let's see. Oh, <laughs> I thought you have the original I one. I do. <laughs> and I love the original one. Oh. I love Girl of Now. Oh, man. I can kind of, now that I know that it's Ellie Saab, I can kind of see get that strip Elisa, of the pineapple yeah and then dna the yeah, yeah like the the elisa go oh, the girl of now dna not girl of now is this girl of now girl of now something it's shine shine yeah this is the pineapple the second flankers they have two flankers this is the one with the gold paddle and then they have yeah. a pink one too isn't that's the one forever What's this, one? this one's oh, shine. shine and then forever okay yeah, yeah i mean it's not bad but it's not my favorite. I prefer yeah. the original. No, I guessed that already. Yeah. <laughs> so. <laughs> All right. That's it, guys. Yep. You oh, yeah. Don't forget. Um, we're going to do a similar video on my channel, but with my fragrances. So be sure to check that video out as well. Yeah. And like, subscribe to this channel and her channel. All right. Bye-bye. See you guys. See ya.